Hello, my name is Jupiter Hadley, and today we're playing Hollow Vista. This is a bit of a weird game to describe. You basically, it's kind of like a hidden object game and a puzzle game. You started off as this girl who didn't really have a job, wasn't quite financially stable, but does have a lot of friends and a social media presence, and you are sort of exploring her life. She applies for this job because she's interested in architecture and gets it somehow for this huge company that is a bit sketchy, but still is a, a good company that pays well. And then you start doing your job, but for whatever reason, instead of being paid to sort of design architecture or do anything like that, you're paid to take pictures and put them on social media. Um, at first, Everything seems all right. The rooms are beautiful. They almost are designed for you. Everything is just wonderful. It's high, expensive. It's quite nice. Um, things start to turn a bit weird, however, when items are seemingly from your own memory or your own imagination, many of which are stuff that other people wouldn't have videos of you that were never submitted online, items that literally are pictures that you've painted of your sister who people haven't, who these people shouldn't have put anywhere, clothing that fits you perfectly despite you thinking this is just a house and just a, a place that you need to be looking at. So you do start to feel a bit weird. You start to wonder what's going on and your friends start to hear on social media, basically, that you're not acting the way that you should be acting or the way that you're normally acting. And as you go through these rooms to take pictures, you're kind of exploring these weird scenes of your own memory. And um, they bring back memories. The game split up into many different parts. This is just one of them. So this is sort of finding all of these different pictures. We're getting towards the end of this. Oc party mask. Oxygen. Tank. I find a lot of these rooms to be absolutely overwhelming. Like, is this a party mask? Like, behind there? No. Because there's just so much going on. And they've gotten more and more, like, wild as time comes. There's oxygen tanks. We do have a hint system. You get one hint per level. And there's no, like, in-app purchases for more, so... I use it for the very last thing most of the time. Now that we've taken all of our pictures, it's moving us on to the feed version of the story. So you're given a description, and then you have to find the right picture for it. I'm so tired, but I felt the need to write a little. It's good to get your thoughts on paper. This isn't actually writing, so what I'm saying doesn't make sense anymore. And these are my friends. I've been mean, following your post. It's amazing. What kind of show is this? Show. Uh, stealth ARG. I get it. A camera, and that's not writing. It just looks like a bunch of spilled ink. Really, it's not what it looks like to me. So sometimes these people kind of talk about you, or you can see your own comments to them, and that kind of builds this entire story. I don't remember writing on this mirror, but on the bright side, I'm 100% sure I am alone here, so it just means I'm going crazy. You can change filters and stuff, but I don't really care about filters uh, myself, to be honest. Look at you, what does that mean? Maybe take a picture of yourself in the mirror. No, I'm not looking in that mirror. It's kind of creepy, you know? It's kind of creepy. Some of these people are my siblings. Um, once you finish doing these posts, you often have conversations with them. Um, and they talk to you about what's going on in your life and what they feel. This company is doing really dodgy stuff with your memories, so it's, it's definitely interesting. Comments have been restricted for your account by Mesmerators. Okay, that's a bit weird. What, I only just got... Oh, I just got comments shut down? That's an interesting development. Apparently we can't comment on stuff anymore. From my place of work. These are the roses Dad bought me when I was in the hospital. I think they grow here. I mean, there are definitely some weird blue roses. This game actually uses AR, so if you wanted, when you were taking pictures, instead of scrolling around like I was, you could definitely um, move around the room. I haven't been using the moving around the room stuff before. Oh, restricted, I can't comment. Interesting. 
uh, basically because I don't care for it. This almost looks the same picture twice. We had a picture of drinks, didn't we? Oh, that's this one. It literally won't affect me, liquor won't affect me. This is definitely pretty, uh, interesting. <laughs> As a story. I mean, I feel like the biggest, biggest downfall to the game is that the graphics are, like, quite intense. Um, what's reaching out from beneath the bed? Um, so this, if you paid attention in the room, it'll give you answers to these sort of questions. I believe it's tentacles or octopus, but I'm going to put in tentacle. Because I don't know if it was an octopus. No. Octopus. Maybe just one tentacle? Since I got here, no matter where I go, I hear a dripping sound, always from just outside my field of vision. I've been living with the sound for three days now. Three days like standing beneath a tree in the rain, clinging in anticipation of the first cool droplet hitting my neck, waiting for the rain to come a storm. So we're done posting pictures now, we're at the end of the feed, and we can move over to this area. This is actually my work. Uh, we've, <laughs> we've continued to deviate from baseline parameters. Dissociating friction has reached unacceptable levels. For your safety, we've limited and focused your online engagement. So, fortunately for everyone, that's not true. Your contract gives authority over your privacy things. So this is us arguing with the brand that's actually hired us for this very weird job. Oh, the representative's no longer there. Yeah. So this is us just sort of <laughs> organizing what we're doing as opposed to becoming birds avoid nether screams or examples. So the building itself is kind of building a world for us. Trust us. We'll be in touch soon. You should try to sleep. Right. Um, and then this is just our friends talking with us. So they're trying to build a house that sort of changes with you, but they're not doing it in the right sort of way. So I've been up for days trying to figure out what's going on with my mind. I quite like the lack of control we have in responding and in what we're doing. I think that it makes more sense to have a lack of control because it's building this very scary storyline that I probably wouldn't have gone down otherwise. Um, I think that this is a really interesting game. I think the AR is a bit unnecessary. I don't use it. I've not used AR in other games. And I do feel that the graphics of the individual people, like these, her, lots of other people, could be more realistic. They feel kind of fake realistic. Uh, I quite like this guy. He seems great. We might date. Don't know. Um, this is my sister. We talk a lot as well. And uh, these are also the different days of the week. Each day is a, a different level, basically. And you can go back and fill in passwords that you've got locked. I have no idea what that one, what that one was, to be honest. But they tell you at first just meaningless garbage, almost, that are going through a brain. But after time, it becomes more relevant to the story and following it. Uh, I hope that I don't die in this house, to be honest. This game is only out on iOS, and it's $4.99. So if you're looking for a sort of hidden adventure game that's not cheesy, hidden adventure game, hidden object game that's not cheesy, um, and that has a deep, rich story, this is a very good one to pick up. And it's got some very interesting futuristic concepts um, that remind me of um, sort of future horrors. Someday people are going to trap us into realities that we're creating as our own is definitely an interesting concept. Uh, that's all from me today. Thank you very much for watching and liking and commenting and subscribing. Bye.